Hey everybody, the Bonga's back. Welcome to part 38 of Let's Play Pokemon Conquest, brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Alright, speaking of conquest, we're pretty much continuing our conquest that should be anything but a conquest. Because really, we just need 100 Pokemon, and we're a quarter of the way there. But to make things easier on us, of course we're going to be doing lots of conquering. That is the whole premise of this game in the first place. I think I'll only take these four for now. Should I take you, the Sneasel? I don't see a reason why not. And over here, I think I'll bring Dragonair. Yeah, let's do it. All right, time to hit Viperia real hard. Oh, so many memories in this place. Thankfully, all of them were good. I like to keep it that way. Okay, of course, it's a banner mission. I haven't forgotten that much. Sneasel, I think I'm gonna have you go for the other banner over here. Everyone else can pretty much just go in attack mode. Good thing for a secret passage, because Steelix would take a hundred years to get there. And we can't get over there. Oh, that's right, because Rufflet's flying. Duh. I'm an idiot. Yeah, I'm just gonna have, like, one attack force go to the right, and then somebody else will go to the left. Alright, well, that's fine by me. You know, with that bug type, it would have been nice to have, probably bring Larvesta with me. Oh, they got something interesting on the go here. How much can I do to you? 15! You know what? That's not bad. I think Sneasel should be able to tank both these Pokemon at once. But should I bring him some backup? You know what? Your part normal. I think you can take advantage of this. Go back him up. I think we got a really good squad for this mission. We should be able to take Nene out pretty fast. If everything goes according to plan, of course. And I'm actually counting on just that happening. Oh, running away, huh? I don't know if that was exactly a wise decision for you, but you do you. How much can I do? 30. Ooh, this'll take him out! Time for Iron Head! Phrasing, Ieyasu. Ooh, you're gonna one-shot that Venipede! That's right, my talent is awesome. Wish I could say the same for you. Dragonair only has 28 HP? Really? Oh, okay. Probably because of his energy level being neutral. There's no sense of you trying there, Nene. I'm gonna freaking own ya. Oh, this'll hit anyway! Sure, I'll go for it. It's a low chance, but let's go for it. Oh, I got a crit as well! 
Did I just recruit her? I think I did. I'm liking how that dialogue went. Which one did you take? Well, I guess it doesn't matter. You go to this one. I picked the wrong one. <laughs> um, go this direction, I suppose. We only need to take out the Ekans and get that last banner. And that Missy ain't leaving her Ekans to go get the other banner, leaving this banner unprotected. Although I would not have minded. Uh, no sense to use Fortify. That passage leads to the other banner. It does! Nice! Sadly, my Steelix needs to still move another space. Or have be more than one round. But I think that should be okay, all things considered. We pretty much got this fight won. With little effort. I'm not immune to poison, so... Am I immune to poison? No, I'm, I can't, because you can tell. Like, as soon as you see the bubbles, that's pretty much a dead giveaway. So we're not going to do that. I'll take out that Ekans and then you can claim the banner. All part of the master plan. Man, if only you had a range upgrade or something ability to increase your range. That would have been great to have. Still my turn. <laughs> I can just grab that gift because I'm immune to steel. I mean, immune to poison because I am steel. Can't talk today. It's the second video of this session. Totally kicked their ass. This is a good squad. I like this squad. Ooh, we get Hanzo as well. That's awesome. Yeah, this is the first time I recruited him. We have a Golbat. We have Spirit Tomb. 90% on that one. Ghost and Poison. So I'm guessing you would prefer, like, Ghastly and whatnot. What do you prefer? Poison, alright. And we didn't find your best Pokemon yet. I want to put you... I guess it doesn't matter. Put you over here. Actually, come to think of it, Avia is unguarded very well. save and do a little bit of expediting before we advance time we've pretty much taken like the head of Ransay as well as some of the belly I'm looking at the progress so far what can I have you guys do snow rut do I have anybody with a tendency to like ice you. Well, I already got what I need from you. Let me 
me take a look in the other kingdoms that I have. Especially over here. Hiroko? Let me move you over to uh, next door. Take the dude with a magic carpet to go over there. Don't think we should do too much when it comes to, like, recruiting or finding other Pokemon until later. We already got, like, 34 Pokemon in just one battle because we found dudes that had a lot. I don't consider that pretty bad at all. Let's put you guys on training. I need to have strong units. Alright, advance time. Let's see what happens. It's July. Bonga's army has appeared in Kanbei's region of Ignis. Hey, I'm attacking! Even though it's not exactly me. And I lost. <laughs> Kenshi's army has appeared in Ujiyasu's reach of Cragspur. Ooh, Kenshin actually succeeded. Ooh, Yoshimoto has attacked Genshio. Can't say I like your chances. Yeah, you lost. <laughs> Oh god, Shingen has attacked Yoshihiro? Okay, now we're seeing where lots of crazy stuff is happening. Ask for a favor? Uh, a thousand bucks. Alright. I'll be nice. Okay, so Kenshin's over there. Can I take a Luzio pretty easily? I I guess I could. Hmm. Just a Chimchar, an Abra, because of course I only use Teleport, and a uh, Scraggy. I guess I can deal with. This is not a bad lineup. Who can I bring to back you up? Yes, you. Maybe not so much you. I can only bring like one dude. Or on well, I'll only be allowed to attack Henshin first. I would imagine I can only attack kingdoms with Ieyasu anyway. Let's um try to divide them for now. Like, force them to do some splits. So I'll move you. Deal with the Scraggy, probably the Rufflet. Who else do they have? Abra? Well, I don't think it matters who I bring there. Let's see, can I just do battle? I guess I don't have to bring Ieyasu? Hmm, okay. Actually, do I need all of you? I can probably just bring... I'll bring five of you. You know, it's good to know that I don't always have to bring Ieyasu for this. This kind of delegates things a little bit. Let my B team take some weaker kingdoms, and then the A team will go after the Warlords, pretty much. Besides, I need to let Hanzo get some action.
Okay, can't say I'm really a fan of this arena. So I might as well take it under my control while there's a weaker army. I should have just left that banner unguarded to have them go for it. But you know what? Whatever. Okay, we're stretching ourselves thin. But I think it's well worth it. Besides, we only need to worry about, what, two attackers? Because Abra can't really fight back. Where are you going? This platform is not going to levitate because I'm flying, right? Oh, never mind it. It, it still is. Let's see if I can bait him. Rackstar should be able to do just fine. So you know what? Go in the fray. You'll risk getting hit, but that's all right. I'm gonna wait for the portals to allow me to get to their base. Okay, looks like the uh, Chimchar wants to fight. Uh, yeah, we kind of need victory, otherwise we can't really get more land. So I don't know what you're talking about. Ooh, you're gonna do a nice lot. You know what? I don't need to use my ability. There, Scraggy's down. How much can you do? Only five? Really? Wait. We can just about claim everything now. I'll bring Spiritomb over, because this is as good a chance as any to get that Abra eliminated. Now, was this a wise choice? Who knows? Oh, you're going to go after my Rufflet, eh? Maybe not the best choice. I'll let you, ooh, lower by 89. As much as I like to get Hanzo get the kill, if I do it like this, I'm guaranteed to grab the banner this turn. So I think that was pretty much the wisest decision. And we win. We didn't even have to beat that Shimshar. They all retreated? Wow. Did they go to Kenshin instantly? I don't think they did. So I think we can still fight them. Alright, so what do you have? Fighting and Psychic, so a Dark type would be great, and luckily I have one. Rock type... Uh, steel is good against that. Uh, steel is also good against ice, apparently. That's for Psychic, Dark type. Fire type, uh... Don't have a ground type, so I guess I'll make do with what I have. And for Rufflet, it's pretty much inconsequential. Haunter would also be good here. You know what? I'll take you as well. I'm glad I'm not hamstrung to only attack once per month. So if I have a really good squad, I can probably take entire swaths of territory so fast. Oh god. They're not gonna stand a chance.
This is a bit interesting we're fighting Kenshin here in Kragsburg. Not surprisingly, Ujiyasu is there with him. I can let Haunter go to the other side. It may not be such a bad idea. I do have to open that gate. There. Now everybody has free reign. You're steel, so rock types won't hurt you that much. Who's over on this side? Uh, maybe I should have Laron go this way. There. I made an arrow! <laughs> Alright, what you got, buddy? I will assume you don't have much. I like Kenshin. Kenshin's pretty good. But then again, that's because I had an affinity for liking psychic types since Gen 1. Because they were so overpowered in Gen 1 before they brought in Dark types. And even then, I still like Psychics. Ooh, I can totally rock your world. Ooh, I think you just joined me. You made a wise decision. Two treasures will appear? Do I care to use it now? No, actually. Well, you're gonna handle this pretty well. Can you hit him? Thirteen. Hmm. Well, you're not gonna do that much to me anyway. Well, I guess you'll do something to haunt her. But Sneasel, not so much. So we can both go after you. Only 40? Sure, let's go for it. Ah, I kinda wish I could reach that other boulder. Might destroy the rufflet that way. Good, I made him flinch. Prime opportunity to get stuff done. Back Laron up. I knew you'd do that. Ooh, 154! Okay, we suffered one casualty. So we know that Kenshin is really strong. Okay, we gotta get rid of that Panzer. You lucky bloke, I must say. How much will I do against you? 63?! How, how much attack power do I have? Jeez Louise! Pretty much a killer! Here, I'll knock you over to us. Sorry, Dwayne Johnson, I destroyed you. <laughs> Did I already use my... Yeah, I already used it. Come on, hit them both. Damn. The one guy I really wanted you to hit, you didn't. 
You know what? Go after you. Come on, dog. Couldn't give it to me. There. I put a rock to sleep. My crowning moment. You're still sleeping. It's only been one turn. God, you're so impatient. Jeez. Oh, he's going on a tear. He's looking to destroy us, I must say. I dig the aggression, though. Well, at least I have some psychic resistance. Now we can finally finish you off. Now all that's left is the, um, friggin' Gallade. So come at me, bro. You only do two damage. That's so much better. It doesn't finish him off, really? Okay. Oh, you have parry! Forty-nine! God, that's the lowest odds I've had with this so far. Oh my god, it worked! Oh, oh, that's beautiful. You know what? Hit this rock to celebrate. You know, good to know that didn't wake him up or anything. Uh, I think I'd rather the Harmony Flute. Oh, that's 38? Oh, but I got a crit! There, we won. <laughs> That was a very productive go at things. And we got like four guys. Three of them are warlords. Okay, you're new. You got an Aaron. Hmm. I guess I can only get perfect link if, say... Probably not Glalie, but if I get Aya to level 2, or rank 2. I didn't get your best Pokemon on the previous run, which I think was Abra or Kadabra on them. You say Hide, yeah, I know you're not that great. Dark. Well, at least you have two Pokemon. So you know what, I'm gonna let you use the Machop whenever I get around to using you. Ujiyasu, I think you can... I don't think we need you there. We'll probably need you there. Because Yaksha still is a nice real estate. And uh, Terrera is picking up in strength too. Pokemon we have so far. I imagine we got a lot. 43. Jeez, we're almost halfway there. Oh, I already got you on training. That's good. That's good. I don't have to worry about, like, where I'm gonna put everybody, because, like, you know. There's still some warlords we gotta defeat. I think you're gonna be our next target, Kai Kaiji. Or KG. 
Although, Shingen's looking really strong. I can't have you get too strong on me. God, my army just sucks. Funny enough, like, around here, like, we're probably gonna get there last, they have, like, the weakest army. So, let's advance time, see what happens. I feel bad for one of my dudes in Avia, because he's all by himself. Oh, Kanbei is going after Motonari. And failed. Yoshihiro is going to attack Kanbei. I kind of figured you would succeed after, you know, a failed invasion. Strike the iron while it's hot, I guess. So, yeah. This looks pretty interesting. It, Yoshihiro's got two territories. Attacking Pugilist might be the best choice, because... His army's just all the way, I think, over here. So that means they're completely overextended. Unfortunately, I don't think I'd be able to march over there, though. I'm gonna need some strong armies, like... Have one army here to take that. Another army here to take that. And have another army to take that. I can have, like, a three-pronged attack. But I gotta think about who I'm going to attack who with. So, it'll be an interesting decision. And I got 57 more Pokemon to get. So I'm gonna stop here, and in the next episode, we shall uh, continue on our total annihilation of Rancé. See ya, everybody!